Hey, what's up guys? It's Catherine with Culture Slate and we are watching the third movie in our spooky movie marathon. It is The Witch. Um, the Witch, as I've heard it called. Um, I'm excited about this one. This is one that I actually wanted to see when it came out. Um, and I heard then that it wasn't particularly scary, which means I'm going to get scared anyway, let's just face it. But um, what interested me in this is it's very much like a period piece horror supernatural thriller thing. Um, also, it's got Anya Taylor-Joy in it, and I absolutely love her. She's a phenomenal actress, so I'm very excited um, to see her once again in the lead role in this. So I, I'm very excited because I am really interested in kind of the, the like Salem witch trial type thing. Um, not necessarily just for the idea of like witches and things like that, but because of the idea of mass hysteria. And it is something which um, having majored in anthropology is just very interesting to me because these things do happen. These are uh, very real phenomenon. Anyway, um, I've already bored you with that, so I'm sorry about that, but uh, let's get into it. I'm very excited. I'm so excited I'm finally seeing this. Very happy that um, it was voted on as one of the picks for our Spooky Movie Marathon, so let's go ahead and get into it. Oh, I love the text, the font. I heard that the script one way out into this wilderness to find. Yeah, is written in a alternate for like a country. historical form of English. We must ask thee to be silent. Was it not? They look very scared. Are they just scared in church? I cannot be judged by false. Oh, okay. It's a it's a, a court it's a joke. Okay, that's why. So say. So already they're kind of like isolating them. Creating an isolated situation. Hmm. That's my name. Weird. Wow. Oh, is that is the mom played by the lady? Yeah, it's the lady who plays um Lysa in Game of Thrones, which she already creeps me out, so that's gonna make this great. <laughs> She's so weird in that show. It seems very desaturated and dark. For the sake of thy son. Is this a Welsh? Oh, what accent is this? They seem like they're really setting up this gateway for evil to kind of permeate this family. What? What? Where did the baby go? That was like a fraction of a second. Shouldn't they all be up? Because it's like right outside <laughs> wasn't that a thing <laughs> we all had to get up like right at the crack of dawn we can search no more Karen. we cannot oh my gosh Caleb, our harvest cannot last the winter we must catch our food if we cannot grow yeah we will conquer this wilderness it will not consume us. so i guess there's another baby it's a lot, a lot of kids, but I guess that was normal for that time period. So many children though, wow. Mom is like traumatized, oh my gosh. Did she just do that all day? The camps don't tell me what thy corrupt nature is. My corrupt nature is empty of grace. Bent unto sin, only unto sin, and that continually. So. <sighs> it's like that's your that's your schooling we must lay it again. i guess that's like really the only thing that matters in their society though it's just like survival and religion 
oh gosh, this makes me nervous. It's a freaking bear trap or animal trap. It's not a bear trap. It's too small for a bear. <laughs> animal trap. Tell me. Tell me what? Is he an owl? Kayla. Oh. And if I died, if I died this day. What is this? I hold deeply in the so Listen to not pardon. Young yet. And if God will not hear my prayer, Caleb. tell me. But I cannot tell thee that. No, we can't. Okay, I'm trying to. The dialogue is a little difficult to understand. So, if I understand correctly, he was basically asking. I don't know if they're allowed to go to church or what the deal is. So, is the boy afraid that that has some kind of bearing on their religious status and whether they would he would be able to get into heaven or not oh it's a dead baby chicken he seems very concerned i was not raised religious so i'm not 100 percent sure of the rules especially with like puritanism um no idea how it works <laughs> so I'm, I'm trying to understand what the concern is here is it gonna miss Oh my gosh! Is he not gonna be able to see out of an eye now? Did he lose an eye? What's happening? Uh -oh. Newton, stop that! Is that their goat? Caleb, open the gate. Oh, it is their goat. Okay. We went to find apples. Why don't they tell them they were hunting? Is it they don't want them to worry about the crops? Father wanted it a surprise to cheer you. And... They're like building massive distrust in this family. Really building this chaos. Wow, that's not good. But I, I mean, I kind of see what they're doing here. It's like if they don't, if they're united and, you know, trust each other and they're really trying to isolate everyone, it seems like emotionally and they're all isolated physically from the rest of the settlement obviously too so who's there i need a witch of the woods oh my gosh mercy come out i be not mercy i need a witch of the woods i've seen her in her riding cloak about the woods it was a witch no it was a witch mercy she gonna scare her with it it was i liar Stop! You're just screwing yourself over now. If I'm not tell us thy mother of this, a witch thee and thy mother, and draw us too. Stop thy tears and swear thy silence. That's intense. Why did she do that? She's trying to make her afraid of her, so she'll listen. She wonders if her mother really does hate her. Is she gonna accuse her of taking it? Where is it gone then? Throw your daughter under the freaking bus. Oh my gosh, she blames her for everything. Oh my god, oh my gosh. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. The goat and everything, ooh. Oh, no. I don't like it. Oh, that rabbit. Okay. She's not getting sleep. It's like contributing to just like stress. You're too stressed if you don't sleep. You get crazy if you don't sleep. She's just being more convinced that her mom hates her. We cannot back to that church. We will starve. Oh man, the kids don't need this. Just see her as another mouth to feed, not a child. She's still a child. 
Was she like 12 at this point? 11? If thou wilt back to sleep and keep silent to this, I promise thee, you need not leave to serve the children, nor any family else. Gosh. Jeez. <sighs> they have to deal with a horse and her. <laughs> Uh, this trip just got like a ton harder. Oh, he's checking the traps. Oh. I thought we did. Nay, we did. No. Remember once he lay upon the table, and father saw him and he said, We will have him for meat. Kate, Kate, we will roast this beast. You must remember that. Mm, you I were remember so that much day. happier. With no glass. Ugh. <laughs> Where's that rabbit back? again? Ooh, evil rabbit. Is that like the witch's familiar or something? Don't do it, kid. No. Ooh, ow. Are the kids going to tell the mom that she took him because she's a witch? Not a good idea. Well, you got yourself lost because you ran after the demon bunny. Oh God, my Lord, I now begin. Oh, help me and I'll leave my sin. For I repent and now shall be. Oh, what a legend. None ever shall destroy my faith. But I now begin. Oh, help me and I'll leave my sin. Look at that angle. Is this like the rabbit perspective? Demon rabbit perspective. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Is the kid gonna die? Oh. He's gonna like try and shoot something scary and they're gonna hear the gunshot in the bathroom and it's gonna be too late. Ah! <laughs> I don't know. Why are you running further? Oh my gosh. Don't do that. No with the scary noises. It's not real. It's a creepy witch. Don't do it, cat! Don't do it, don't do it! Oh no! Ah, that was creepy! I'll set off at first light. I'll not return till I've found him. It would be better to go to the village. It sucks because it always happens when she's around. I'll be back in a two day if any man will return with me. Okay, but you're gonna get sick. I took thy father's cup. Oh, now he's coming out with it. Oh man, he took the cup. You have broken God's covenant. You're a liar. And you've lost another child. I will go now. You cannot escape the world. They're like blaming each other for all of this stuff. They oh, just God. why don't they just John has been a man of the house? Well, you trust each other. Oh now she's all nice to her again. Jeez. This is just like, what? Oh, they're so... It just seems so unstable. And I guess like, given that their life apparently in England was so much better, like it makes sense that they're so stressed, but oh my gosh. She seems like this awful family relationship. What? Oh my gosh, is that him? What? Oh my gosh. How did he even find his way back? Hey everyone, we'll get back to the video in just a second. But first, how awesome is this shirt? Got a little jack lantern, a little coffin. This shirt is perfect for spooky season, and it is only available for a limited time, the month of October, at our Culture Slate store. We have other designs as well. We've got Andor inspired. We have other Star Wars inspired shirts also. We've got She Hulk inspired and our classic Culture Slate logo shirt as well. So you can click the link up here. It'll take you to our Culture Slate store. Go ahead and pause this video for a second. It's okay. I'll wait. 
that kid some holy water or something. I don't know. <laughs> How do you fix it? Ugh. Creepy. The witch got him. What? Why is there a knife? What's happening? Why? No. Uh, why is that necessary? What? Why? That's just bizarre. I can't tell if it's nighttime or daytime anymore. I just, it's very disorienting. What's gonna happen? No, oh, it's the goat. No, don't go around the goat. What else can you expect? What else can you Mother and father will find out what? That you are a witch. Oh man, see, I knew that. I knew I'd come back to bite her in the butt. <gasps> uh oh. Totally. Screwed yourself over just to scare your sister. But in this case, the man might not be on my back. No. What was that? What? Oh my gosh. Is this like tetanus or something? What the heck? It's like a lock jaw. Don't try him. You're going to break his jaw. Oh my gosh. Oh. Poor girl, too. No. This is absolutely nuts. This is going to be creepy. These kids are like really good actors. This is just my lord, terrifying. My lord, kiss me with the kisses of thy mouth. Take me to thy lap. <laughs> oh my god, this is so creepy. So nervous. So creepy. Uh -oh. I don't like it. He's gonna like pop up. I don't trust it. Oh my gosh. Where you going? Please don't sit again. Get off! Oh my gosh. It's like the dad's the only one who believes her. This tree will be lovely come spring. Oh. You remember when we came here? Dad 
looked at this tree and then we did a would have been a proper farm. This is so like horrible. <sighs> they lied. I saw it. Caleb disappeared with Dean. Oh my gosh, she doesn't believe her. Come on, witches, if you will but speak truthfully, as I love thee, speak truth. You asked me to speak truth. Thank you. You took Caleb to the wood and let me take the blame of that too. Is that true? You let She's me right. My master. You cannot bring the crop seals. You cannot hunt. Must I hear the devil wag his tongue in thy mouth? Stop. That's the twins then. Get up. <gasps> oh my god jeez did not need that jonas and mercy they made covenant with the devil in the shape of black philip wake wake from this did ye make some unholy bond with that ghost like, no one trusts anybody. It's, like, even getting worse. God, it's just, like, so much chaos. Nobody knows what's happening or what to believe or... Get these lies from our babes' mouths. They're trifles to them. I do not lie. Silence, creature, and I will smite Jonas as Abraham would have done his seed. No, stop it! Fetch the pillow, and I will stop dash it. his skull! Do you see? Yeah, kill the goat. What the hell? He's just like boarding them all in the house. This is nuts. They all like, oh my god, oh my gosh, he boarded all of them in there with that goat. This is so intense. Yeah, just like lock them in the barn. It's like not humane by any stretch of the imagination. Crazy lady. What? What? No way. She's having delusions. Hallucinations. What? Mm -mm. Nope. Don't do it. Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh! What? Did that not happen? Oh my god, it did happen. Oh my gosh! The two kids gone. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh. Oh my God.
I'm like, what's she gonna do now? Oh my gosh, she's like traumatized. So good. What's that like to live deliciously? What's that like to see? No. Dost thou see a book before thee? Oh my gosh. Remove thy shield. <laughs> He like after her all along, and that's why he did all that. Oh my gosh, there's like a whole coven of them. I thought it was just one. So I guess that woman that Caleb encountered in the woods was an actual one. It's not like a form that the witch was taking, it was like a another one of them. Wow. That's pretty nuts. Is that it? Oh my gosh. Intense. Oh, okay. So it's inspired by folk tales, fairy tales, historical accounts. Okay, that's really neat. That was a really good movie. It was very much like a period piece. Not, yeah, I, I mean, I guess, but yeah, based on um, folk tales and fairy tales and just like stories of witches, but they also kind of incorporated the historical aspect of, you know, the idea of having a witch in your family or in your village and what that does to people. And that made for some incredibly tense situations, just like everybody basically, I mean, the kids basically accusing each other of like being witches and um Thomas and basically screwing herself over in the beginning just by trying to scare her sisters like that was such a bad move um and then finishing out the ending with that very kind of folk tale-y gathering of witches and Thomas and becoming a witch in the end which was a really eerie kind of ending and solidified kind of that supernatural feel and everything that I think the movie had going throughout and then um Black Philip really being the devil. I'm still I guess a little bit confused like were the kids I guess the kids would have been witches if Black Philip was talking to them. I don't know. Like they I I don't know. I guess that's probably one of the things that's kind of left up to interpretation and like I don't know if those kids they might not have been baptized either because I don't think I saw them at the beginning when the family left the plantation. I think it was just Caleb and Thomason as far as I know. I can't, I don't know why I can't remember. 
like an hour and a half ago, but I can't. So it could have just been that they weren't as protected, I guess, because they weren't like baptized within the church. I don't know. It, uh, yeah, there's just lots of things to think about. And I always, um, as I think about these movies and shows that I watch, the days after I do watch them, I kind of get more and more, uh, you know, I process more and more and get more and more of an idea of kind of what they were going for. And I think about them a lot. So um, that'll probably happen. And I'll probably talk about the movie with some people who've seen it and, and kind of, you know, gather my thoughts more on it. But it was so good. I really loved um, the costuming, the sets, the um, script that was written the way it was, the music. Oh my gosh, the music from the get-go was really just setting that really, really tense tone. Um, so yeah, it was really good. I definitely would recommend this one. So, all right, guys, um, if you like my Culture Slate logo shirt, uh, you can get it at our Culture Slate store. You can click the I at the top of the screen to support our channel. Um, you can also like and subscribe if you'd like to support us in that way as well. It helps us out and lets us keep making awesome content for you guys. Also, you can join our Discord. Um, we kind of hang out, talk about music, music, movies, sometimes music, but mostly movies and shows and um, comics and all sorts of fandom stuff. And so it's a lot of fun over there. So um, go ahead and join us over there if you would like. And that's all I've got for you guys today. I will see you next time for our final uh, spooky movie in our spooky movie marathon. Bye, guys.